Reuniting words. Understanding. Get back together. Hello, language enthusiasts. Today, we're diving into a very common and emotionally charged phrase in English. Get back together. This phrase is often used in personal relationships and carries a significant meaning. Stick around to understand every nuance and context where you might encounter this phrase. Get back together literally means to reunite or come together again after a period of separation. It's commonly used to describe a couple who has decided to rekindle their relationship after a breakup. But it's not just limited to romantic relationships, it can also refer to friends or band members who decide to reunite after a period apart. Understanding, get back together, goes beyond just the words. It's wrapped in emotional context and implications. For many, this phrase symbolizes hope, forgiveness, and a second chance. It's important to understand the emotional weight this phrase carries, as it can deeply affect the individuals involved. Let's see how, get back together, is used in sentences. 1. After months of being apart, they decided to get back together. 2. The band got back together for a reunion tour. These examples show the versatility of the phrase, being apt for personal, professional, or creative reunions. The phrase, get back together, is often seen in movies, songs, and literature, usually revolving around a dramatic plot of separation and reunion. It's a testament to the universal nature of the concept of reconciliation and the human desire to reconnect. We hope this exploration of get back together helps you understand not just the words, but the deep emotional and cultural layers it encompasses. Remember, language is not just about words. It's about people, emotions, and stories. Happy learning, and see you in our next linguistic journey.